This whole idea of having a smart antimicrobial coating actually come okay, uh, from a company because at that time they are interested to see whether there's a possibility, okay, just after the SARS okay, episode in Hong Kong, is there a possibility to have a coating materials that is, can actively okay, keep a surface clean for a very long time? How long? We are talking about 30 days or more. We borrowed technology okay, that are related to targeted drug delivery, uh, technology that are used for curing cancer. What it does is transform the coating materials from something that is passive to something that is smart. That means to say nowadays the coating, if I touch it, those areas that I touch will be contaminated. So what the coating will do, it will actually self-disinfect those areas and self-clean. One of the other features of this coating is that it actually controls the dosing of the biocide on the surface in such a way that it prevents the emergence of tolerance or resistance in microorganisms and bacteria. That is the cause of the major problem right now with these multi-drug resistant organisms. By doing that, you can prevent the transmission of SARS, transmission of influenza, transmission of other type of pathogen okay, on, from surfaces.